See that car rocking? We're going on a road trip. guys so you guys didn't see it but I'll show you guys later I just jumped off a tree with a rope I know I saw you so one of the girls was like I'm scared I can't jump off the tree then we said we're going to the beach she was like I'm going to the beach let's go so she jumped so it was really fun oh my gosh I don't know who they are I don't know Nike G cam y'all subscribe to Wicked Away you already know YouTuber in the world no, she ran. I All I can say is wow. Because it's just beautiful blue water. You like taste? Do you? Yeah. This is the Japanese. Wow. I thought we take off the shoes over there. Yum. Yum. Y'all want Sandy? I'm glad we have a broom. We do have a broom. Yeah, we do. Kitchen area. I guess this is like the linen closet or cleanup closet, whatever you call it, slash linen. Our fridge. And just to give you an idea of how tall the fridge is. No, you never was tall enough. Because Japanese fridges are small. I know. Uh, nice lighting in the bathroom. Hey guys. Hey. <laughs> it took a minute for it to adjust. I'm so hot. Oh. All right. So shower rooms. One toilet. Two showers. So this is one shower. And. Oh, yeah, you want me to? Oh, nothing. Oh. All right, another shower. This is the downstairs. Sorry. This is, this is, the, you're not on the vlog like that. All right, this is the downstairs, and we have upstairs. I'll show you guys later. Yeah. We have two? Oh, but. If they split, then one of us is going to have to separate to make sure they don't creep out. Yeah, that's how it's going to be. Alright, so, and stairs to lead upstairs. I'll show you guys later. But it's opposite. So there's one person who hides in the field or somewhere. So usually like one person try to find everyone else, but it's the opposite. So when you find that person hiding, you hide with him or her. Oh. So that's the They just explained the game sardines. So somebody's gonna hide. We're gonna hide with that person, and then everybody else 
finds the location and then you hide with him. So Let's that's what it. we're doing. Let's get it. All right. I want to do it again. I know. Yeah. You are looking dead at him right now. Right there. One minute left. One minute left. Oh my God. One minute. One. 24. 23. So I'm scared again. 22. 21. 20. 19. 8. 7. 6. I'm scared again. 5. 4. I gotta do it. But I'm okay. <laughs> I ran into this and then I had to jump down. Ooh. It was hot in the car. Okay. They're crazy. They all hid in the car, by the way. There they are. It's like a song, oh my gosh. Look at then the kids had a time where they had to go to the chapel and listen to a devotion from one of the pastors. It was really good, strong, powerful message about relationships and that how we need to have a relationship with God. And I think the kids thoroughly enjoyed it. This was my first time being a chaperone on a trip like this. Camping trip and my first camping experience overnight in a cabin. So thoroughly enjoyed it. Afterwards, we ended up cooking some hot dogs and hamburgers, and the kids had some chips as well, and then we did a bonfire. That pan is currently on fire because of grease and cheese. Hey, Miss Cabernet, take two because we need to get good lighting. But we love you, and you need to come to our next field trip. Bye. To Miss Cabernet, our chaperone, to the most amazing chaperone. Hey, is this not working? <laughs> we need to get that good lighting. Yeah. So I'm stuck in the loud room, chaperoning. Why are you here? Chaperoning. Why are you, here? you guys. Excuse me. All the loud people up there. Uh, this is my cot area where I'll be sleeping. I have these little cushions, kind of like I don't know like a car visor and I'm gonna pop a spot right here go to sleep so camping is fun I'll show you guys the ocean water view tomorrow and I'll see you guys hopefully I can sleep in this cabin I survived guys we're packing up at this camp I don't even know if I showed you guys the ocean but we're gonna go down and look at it one more time let me know if you've ever been a chaperone before because I have bags under my eyes because these kids did not go to sleep until like 2, 3 a.m. in the morning. I'm a night owl, but not that late. How do you do that? Uh, boys running around at 5.30. At 5.30? Yeah, we're like, y'all better be out the room at 6. Today this morning. Oh my gosh. That's <laughs> fantastic.